guys, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new, welcome to my channel. My name is Alexa, and in today's video, I will be letting this jar, this TBR jar, choose my reads for a week. So today, well, technically, it's st I'm starting this tomorrow. On Wednesday, I'm going to end this on Tuesday next week. Um, so basically, I put a bunch of reading prompts that I found on Pinterest, online. There was this one TBR jar generator thing that I also used. Um, it, had, it might seem very empty, but it has 50 different prompts. I'm not planning on using them all because I don't... I, I read a lot, but I don't read that much. Um, but I've just been trying to get through my physical TBR and just my general TBR. I have a few books that I can read on my Kindle. Uh, but yeah, it's like, it's not a book, it's a prompt, and then I can choose a book based on this prompt. Um, so I'm just gonna pick tomorrow's read now. I'm gonna pick this out of the jar. And yeah, let's see, okay. Guys, you see I'm shaking this? I'm not cheating, right? I don't know what I'm gonna pick. Choose that. Okay. Ooh, a book that is first in a series. Wait. First in a series. It's probably upside down right now that you guys see. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, so the, the book I chose is Binding 13 by Chloe Walsh. Um, I'm already about 200 pages in. I'm gonna start I know I'm 200 pages in, but I think I'm actually going to restart it because I cannot remember really what happens. And I really want to annotate it, so I'm going to restart it, and I'm going to be reading this 600-page book. Start it tomorrow. Most likely not going to finish it tomorrow. This one's probably going to take me two days, but like shorter books can take me a day. So yeah, I'm not allowed to start reading this until tomorrow because the video, the video doesn't officially start until then. But I'm really excited because this is on my priority TBR and just... I've been scared to read it just because the books are about to get re-released in new covers by Bloom and I don't have the budget right now to spend my money on the whole series but we'll see how it goes. Worst case scenario, I'll just buy the ebook at some point but yeah. Okay so I decided I'm not gonna restart Binding 13 but I will be like annotating it while I continue so it is now Wednesday night. Haven't read all day, but I'm about to start now. So yeah, I, I guess let's get into this book. I don't know. If I have any major reactions, I will film an update. Hey guys, so yesterday I ended up reading another book because I just, I don't know, I couldn't get into it. Sorry, the lighting feels weird right now, but I'm going to read this book. Also, if you notice the different camera quality, it's because I changed phones. So yeah. just finished just finished crying over binding 13 i'm very lucky that i don't look like i would just bald my eyes out when i cry i don't know why the lighting is weird right now i still have to figure out the whole camera thing with this phone five stars i've been reading so many five star books this month it's just you know when you just have a month where you keep picking up amazing books so basically i actually read two books with this prompt i also read Mile High by Liz Tom Ford on my phone because I just couldn't read this book at night because it's just too it's too big to be able to read in bed and like you know but I cried so much and I also cried with Mile High I almost never cried with books but I cried two books in a row which I don't know if it has ever happened but now I'm gonna give like I give five stars to both of those books I'm gonna give reviews at the end now it's time to pick the next book so wait, I'm just gonna give it a good shake. And I'm gonna pick, close my eyes, pick a prompt. Okay, let's see. Involving travel. 
I'm gonna try to pick a book and I will come back when I choose the book. Okay, so the lighting is very bright, but I finished uh, the right, instead of reading, actually summer reading, I read The Right Move by Liz Tom Ford, which actually is also involving traveling. That's why I read it, because she's a flight attendant for a hockey team and he's a professional basketball player, so they travel for work, of course. But now it's time to pick the next read. Okay, sorry, I got cut off by a notification for some reason but basically as i was saying i gave the windy series by windy city series by liz tom Ford five stars both of them uh so mile high and the right move by liz tom Ford. i preferred the right move because the main character was a reader and i i love readers i am a reader myself so yeah all right now let's pick the book off the physical t not the physical tbr why do i not why do i keep it off the tbr jar it let's say what book am I gonna read okay hmm. book that's more than 300 pages all right let's go pick that book wait actually I think I'm gonna read I think I'm gonna go with fourth wing by Rebecca Yaros I've been dying to read that book. I have it on my Kindle and I've been actually wanting to uh, read that book because everyone's been raving about it and I just, I've been wanting to read it so much so this will turn into a, I mean I might not finish it tomorrow. If I haven't finished it by tomorrow, which is technically the one week mark, I'm gonna, I'm gonna continue this vlog until I end this book because... I want to, this to turn into a um, fourth wing reading vlog because I want to document it for you guys and I actually might also document it for a TikTok. So yeah, let's start reading, I guess. Well, I'm going to do my night routine and then start reading. Okay, so ignore how I'm laying down on my bed. Um, it's the best lighting that I can have right now in my room with my lights. I'm about to continue fourth wing and I am loving it. So far I read about maybe... 15% this morning and I adored it. I'm addicted to that book. I cannot stop reading it and I did the little like filter thing on TikTok and I got that I'm a I was hoping I'd get a scribe. But I got infantry and honestly I would not survive a day in being a writer or infantry so I would quite literally pass away but let's not talk about that. I'd love to think that I would survive. I wouldn't. But yeah, I am loving it and I love Xayden. But yeah, I will update you guys tomorrow morning probably. Or if I have any major reactions. I'm probably going to film my like reaction to the end tomorrow. But yeah. Okay, so I don't know if the lighting is weird. I'm still getting used to having like, which is apparently, what is apparently good lighting with this phone. Because my old phone didn't have good lighting. Like right now, it would be absolutely dark and you couldn't see me. Right now, it's like pouring outside. But um, as you can tell, like I'm filming the outro of this video. So I'm going to do like the little reviews of the books that I read. And there's one that I didn't document because it was an audiobook. But I'll still talk about it here, I guess. Um, But yeah, I definitely liked this challenge. Though sometimes I did change the book we don't talk about it so for the first book i read in this series is mile high by liz tom ford um that was a book that i found on kindle unlimited i've been wanting to read it for a while it's a hockey romance and i had read another hockey romance i think recently wait had i maybe I'm, no i'm delusional i had not read a hockey romance in months in two months, the last time I had read a hockey romance was actually in April when I read Icebreaker and absolutely loved it. But yeah, that one I gave actually four out of five of the books that I read in this video were five stars. It would I don't know why, like how this happened, but I was just adoring every single book that I read. I mean, I was definitely reading a lot of my five star predictions now that I think about it. Like they were all five star predictions because all of the all of like my favorite booktubers and all that had rated these books five stars so it makes sense honestly now that i think about it so i don't know why i'm surprised um after so yeah that one i loved love 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 loved it, it's not my favorite book in the series but i still adored i would definitely reread it i'm definitely planning on 
like buying it and having a physical copy after that i read binding 13 by chloe walsh um i cried towards the end as you can see uh as you could see and i like almost never cried at books actually i also cried at mile high um when i think about it now two books in a row i cried that almost never happens to me um but yeah i adored this book so much it was so good i love johnny and shannon definitely planning on reading the second book soon though i hate the new uk covers they're giving colleen hoover vibes honestly also just on a side note oh you know i'm actually going to talk about this in my vlog never mind i don't want to do too much of a side note because i don't want you guys to get like bored if you're not expecting just like a normal vlog of me talking um the third book i read is the right move by liz tom ford it's the second book of the series um I, I i love how i'm saying the third book like you guys know this but now i'm just actually giving my thoughts that one was my favorite book in the series i loved it so much it was so good five stars i like i saw in like i don't know not saw myself in indie basically like indie is me when i think about it like i related to her character so much uh she is one of my new she is me characters i just loved her so much i loved her and what is ryan her and ryan they were really cute together and it's just he was the perfect book boyfriend who was modeled after book boyfriends and i need that i want a book boyfriend you know that's all i want well no all, all i want i also want every single i just want also a lot of books but like if you're not talking about like materialistic things that's what i want in life you know after that we have also by the way um is it just better like it feels more cozy right now since like the lighting is really dark i don't know might just be going insane um after that we have fourth wing by rebecca yaros i think this one and the right moves are some of my like six star reads you know instead of like there's like five star read like above five stars i couldn't like it stops at five stars but i wish i could give it like even more like a 20 million percent you know like they were so good i loved fourth wing so much i like for me it's rare that i absolutely adore a fantasy series or like a fantasy book and i adored this one i just it couldn't be more perfect um and actually yesterday when i was in a gift shop i saw a stuffed animal of like a golden dragon and i thought of adarna i think that's what her name is andarna adarna i don't know but like the golden dragon and yeah i just i adored this book so much and the last book that i read was um legendary legendary by stephanie garber which is the second book in the uh caraball series that one i rated it on my goodreads it's a four stars but i actually rated it at 3.75 stars um for me most of the time if i listen to an audiobook like the rating will be like a bit lower than what i would what it would have been if i read it in paperback even though i still love audiobooks it just it takes me a lot longer to get through an audiobook than a paperback so inevitably gonna like sometimes i'm gonna get bored even though i listen to audiobooks in 3x like anywhere between 2x and 3x speed um but yeah i definitely enjoyed it a lot i didn't like it as much as i loved the first book i'm excited to see how they wrap all of this up in the third book which i actually am currently listening to on audiobook Ooh, i think the sun's getting out sorry it's been rainy like on and off all day but it's been gray i'm just hoping that there's some sun but yeah i enjoyed all of the books that i read there's like the one that i didn't document is actually the one that i didn't enjoy as much um but yeah and uh, not this following month but i hopefully will use the tbr jar again at some m moment in time either if it's i redo this video like do it a i don't know three times a year or if it's like a just general tbr video but yeah i hope you enjoyed this video if you did please consider liking commenting subscribing um if you want more of my content go follow my bookstagram my book talk and my description of this video i also have my amazon wishlist my spotify pinterest all those places and my bio so yeah that description uh i hope you have a nice rest of your day morning evening whatever time it is for you guys so yeah bye